Yeah. Let, me, let me ask you a question. Yeah. Who's the bigger legend? Me or Kodak? Not Kodak. I was in LA. Hold on, hold on. I was in LA. Tell them my story and ask them who's the bigger goal. No, oh, we're LA. talking about musically, though. We're talking about music. Fuck the music. We're talking about the streets. <laughs> oh, this guy, man. Yo. Hold on, hold on. Act, 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 act. Yo. They allegedly, they allegedly said I did the race. Yeah. In California. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then yeah. I got arrested by the U.S. Marshals. Yeah. Then I shot a video in jail. And, and I, I go lie. And, and you smashed about like half of those female rappers in LA. Because oh my God. I'm about to text you. Remember that text I sent you last night? Who's here? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna send. I'm gonna leak that tape tonight. And, and by the way, hold on. Last thing. You, you gotta tell you, you, who is that guy in the video? This nigga said he about to leak. The whole purpose of leaking is like you're not supposed to tell people that you're gonna leak something. That's does he know the definition of leak? <laughs> it's not supposed to even if you do it, you're not supposed to say that you did it. This fucking dummy, man. This nigga is a dummy. Video, don't tell me that. Don't tell me that. <laughs> Listen, man. You act, man. I'm gonna holler you on the ones, man. All right, all right, all right, man. I'm gonna holler you the ones. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I love you. Don't say a word. I'm gonna call right, you back. Got you. Drake's. That's your man's. That is Drake's shooter right there. Drake. That's your man's. Hey, this nigga sent me some blackmail shit. I don't know. Hey, listen. For the record, I don't think Drake is telling him to do none of this. But nah, 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 he's Drake Shooter. Nah, we ain't. We, you ain't gonna tootsie slide your way out of this. That is Drake Shooter. We got it on video. He said it. Drake was on the text. He would. Nah, that is Drake Shooter. All right. He said it himself multiple times. That nah, 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 nah. He's an OV ho. Some of y'all niggas who who have, uh, I think it's a Drake angle, because I don't think he got problems with these guys. Nah. He sent me a video of some guy in some really compromising position. I was just like, but they're wearing a chain. I won't say what chain. It's a chain with, I just leave it at that. And I'm like, unless it's a fake, I don't know if it's a fake chain, but I'm trying to figure out who the person is because you're rocking a chain of a, yeah, I'm just leaving it at that. Hmm? What you talking about, Willis? Hmm. Let's play that over again. I'm going to holler you on the ones, man. All right, all right, all right, man. I'm going to holler you on the ones. Yeah, you're right. I love you. Don't say a word. I'm going to call you back. Got you. Hey, this nigga sent me some blackmail shit. I don't know. Hey, listen. For the record, I don't think Drake is telling him to do none of this. But but some of y'all niggas who, who have... Like, d d that knows that this is online, right? Like he does act know what he's saying? Now Act is a very smart person, or he's just I don't He just said that he sent him so now they can come ask you to Oh gee. But I think it's a Drake angle, because I don't think he got problems with these guys. He sent me a video of some guy in some really compromising position. I was just like, but they're wearing a chain. I won't say what chain. It's a chain with, I'll just leave it at that. And I'm like, unless it's a fake chain, I don't know if it's a fake chain, but I'm trying to figure out who the person is because you're rocking a chain of a, yeah, I'm gonna just leave it at that. You know, the thing with top five is like, he's funny and he's entertaining. But like, you know, a lot of people like, hey, he's like, yeah, he's just bullshit, blah, blah. That's kind of like, that's kind of like not true. That's kind of like not true. Anyway, send me a video. I'm like, yo, where the fuck did you get this video from? I don't know. Yeah, the him and Kodak stuff, I'm staying the fuck out of. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to stay the hell out of. Okay. Yeah, boy, you better be itching, boy. <laughs> you, you. <laughs> mm. So, Lil Tyler, um, you know, the good thing is, you know, no one got hurt, which is good. And while we're them likes the Toronto stuff, we should point out that top five has squashed his issues with some notorious people. Um, he had issues with Lil TJ, but that appears to have been squashed. And I don't know if I could find it. Where is the Lil TJ thing? They appeared on FaceTime together, basically almost signaling that, yo, everything's cool right now. Toronto rappers, let me see. I don't know if I can find it, but uh, is it Lil TJ? There was like a notorious thing that went down like at the mall, where I guess they're about to get into it. I don't know, what the hell? Let me just search on Twitter. Like, Instagram needs a search function, bro. Let me see. 
He just got out of jail. No, Top yeah. five, Lil TJ. This dude definitely going back by the end of the year. Yeah, so essentially, you know, they, they both were on, um, you can see here, top five, little TJ, they both got on on FaceTime. He says, I woke up and I chose peace, little TJ, my Gigi for life. Uh, look like they're kind of like, you know, cool now, uh, reasonably. And I don't, I don't that is really. after, I don't know if you guys seen the viral video with, it's like some mall footage with top five, little TJ. Fuck right here, fuck! That, this was like hilarious. TJ, walk on! Fuck right here, fuck! Fuck! Them Gigi's got you, fuck! Fuck, you fucking goof. Come to the corner, man. Stop doing it for the camera. Come to the corner. Come to the corner. Come. TJ, walk on. Fuck right here. Okay, all right. So, so that beef got squashed, and then apparently, um, who else? He squashed me for somebody else. Bro, these are little kids. Yeah. <laughs> these are little kids out here, man. Y'all. Oh. Yeah. Uh, there's another beef. Top five. Everybody? The artist is under Okay, he squashed beef with another guy named, uh, with, uh, his name is DJ Snoopy. We have breaking news coming to you. I'm gonna tell you his significance too. We live from Toronto. The artist is under control. Your Honor, we wanna let you know that this week we'll be promoting peace, love, and unity all week, and we'll be starting with DJ Snoopy. We already squashed the beef with DJ drama across the border this week, so any ops that want to squash the beef, please reach out, and we hope that this will make the CP24 6 o'clock. These guys are now squash beef. Talk news, because the artist is under control, and he is squashing all beef this week. Okay, and if you wonder what his significance is, Top five, apparently. Apparently, here we go. Yo, what time have you done? What time have you done? What range were you on? What range were you on? What range were you on? I'm paying. What's wrong with you, nigga? What you mean, bro? So you gotta know your fucking place, eh? Know your place, bro. Okay, okay. They were beefing crazy. What? Now, eh, eh, eh. Add me goof. Yo, fam, I said on all my dead homies, on everything. Here we go. Yo, no wonder you want to fuck me. Why did you give me? Why did you give your girl and fuck? It's an Airbnb. Are you forgetting you're not my age? I'm just agree with me right now. Uh, before that, my nigga, I'll show you a video. Funny game. Do you, you, you want to cook you? Yo, my nigga, you go to bed. I'm not gonna listen. I'm not gonna listen. Yo, Pete. Yo, Pete. Pee. All right, hold on. Oh, I like I like this guy right here. Oh yeah, yeah. Top five. Yo, watch this documentary. This guy's fire. Child support. This guy's fire. Watch this. Okay, okay. Yeah, he has a whole thing here. But well, let's now focus on the situation in Toronto. Canada's largest city has gone under a four-week lockdown, the second time since the pandemic began. Getting outside the city legislature building in Toronto, protesting, protesting lockdown, lockdown restrictions there. The city leaders I just want to talk about what's happening in Toronto today because people did take to the streets demanding an end to restrictions meant to curb the COVID-19 infection rate. The virus is a smoke screen. It's a hoax. For Toronto, the start of 2020 not only came with the coronavirus, but also the longest continuous COVID-19 lockdown of any major city in the world. As this happened, one of the many trends that were created during that year were Instagram live shows such as Swiss Beats and Timberlands versus and Tory Lanez Quarantine Radio. Well, man, I remember that 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 uh versus that was that was one that was the best versus when uh when it was Dipset and uh and the Lots. That was dope. That was dope. That was dope. For Toronto, the city was blessed with the DJ Snoopy show, which delivered quality moments like this. I block you. Why you have a cluster before me? Me, you think I need to fucking block you? Who are you for me to block? Who am I? Let me tell you. Who are you? Don't play no music. I'm talking. You're now Who listening you? to DJ Snoopy. Who are you? Most requested. You're now listening to DJ Snoopy. Snoopy. Canada's you know most requested. I came to your yard before. Who are you, Snoopy? Listen. If she wants to say she can fuck, what are you gonna say? This That's what you're always on a the show was originally meant for comedic purposes, but as the jokes went on, it got to a point where some people felt disrespected. One of them was Top 5. You see, sometime after the arrest of Flippa, Snapchat videos were leaked, showing Top 5 during his teen years, possibly younger, dancing with a bra on. The clips went viral, with DJ Snoopy going on live immediately to mock Top 5. Yes, hey, Top 5, I have a little video on YouTube. I wear a bra. You guys are supporting a man that wears a bra? <laughs> this was CGI. Man, no dress like that. 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 Man, Seven days. Do it. Do you want to do it? <laughs> seven days. Tell everybody. Everybody watch this. Seven days. Snoopy's not gonna have a chain. Uh, if you agree with me right now. Uh, uh, you, you think we so can sad. do it? You want my chain? We can do it. Do you want to my chain? Seven day challenge. Snoopy. Do you want to wear my chain? mother's life? I will sit on your chain. I'll put on my chain. Why do you want to read? Yeah, I don't know if it's sitting on my chain. I will put right now. Seven days. Snoopy chain. His chain costs twenty five hundred. I'll pay ten bucks for chain. Go get it. Go get his chain. It's over for you. It's over. I'm back. Buy my dog. Pedro, activate it. Listen, listen. One week later. Sometimes I'm not wearing my chain to the mall today. Luckily, I did it. 
someone went and got my pendant, man. They got my brother's pendant. So where is my brother's pendant? Hold my brother, I'll haunt you guys for the rest of your life. Okay, we're at 2,000. Oh, let me screenshot. <laughs> Somebody's gonna screw request. Okay. It flushed! It flushed! We flushed this thing! It's fake! It's fake! We, we flushed. Damn. Yo, Mayu, go to the new jewelry. You should have went to Frankie or Roxy or Kalani. I don't know where you got that fucking shit. Flush that shit. Let's go, yo. Anytime DJ Super is outside, take another chain. Ah, damn. Damn. That's what we trying to tell you. Top five is hilarious, but there's some action behind what he be saying. He funny, yeah. but there's some action. You niggas said seven days. <laughs> it was a, one week later. Anyway, they, they squashed their beef. They squashed their beef, so which is good. Then another beef got squashed, which is top five in DJ drama. Oh my bad, I spelled it wrong. DJ drama. Wait, wait. Top five drama. Why is why is this not popping off? Uh, top five DJ drama. I guess this is only Instagram. Okay, here we go. I searched everything on Twitter. Oh, I posted this. So, so top five. Who's this? Bundog? In drama, they made it right. This is all after the BS that happened. I don't know if y'all remember what happened before. Shout out to Keep Six Solid. DJ drama went to a club up there. Shout out to Mandem. And then I don't know what happened, but they, they, they attacked him and tried to take his chain. <laughs> So, this is what you fucking get for not checking in. Shout out, boy, Drizzy, eh? Yo, the thing, the thing with these Toronto demons, right when they rob a nigga, the first nigga they shot out is Drake. Like, yo, hold <laughs> Yo, Drake gonna get mad. <laughs> man, bro, this dude gonna get Drake in trouble, man. They just, they just letting that shit pile up, boy. They just letting that shit pile up. I know Drake gotta be looking at his phone like... Yo, bro, don't shout me out first. Like, yo, yo, top five gets out and about to get back on his bullshit. The first thing he says, yo, shout out to Drizzy paying my bail for my lawyer. I know Drake is like, me? <laughs> Chill. <laughs> Jeez, you know how you rock slap, blah, blah. This is what you fucking get for not checking in. Shout out, boy, Drizzy, eh? Triple G's, you know how you rock slap. God ah, damn, anyway. <laughs> so, top five is squashed all the beef, bro. That's all I'm trying to say. All the beef Drake is squashed. Up, now, the him and Kodak beef... Um, which I guess affected Lil Tyler. I hope it could get squashed. Wow. Um, if not, who knows? All right. All right. Man. Wow. Let's move on. Let's move on. Let's move on. He definitely going to get Drake okay. locked up. If not oh. locked up, he going to be in a case. Oh, I ain't going to lie.